Spooky Halloween friends, and there are no better game to watch than the Necromancer's Tale. And it's a narrative-driven top-down RPG, where you play a role of the minor noble in the 18th century, down into the dark necromantic arts, as you seek knowledge and revenge. Oh, and I forgot to mention, there will be a Tron-based combat. And every necromancer know, to successfully rise a skeleton, you need to click this like button and subscribe to my channel. And let me tell you more. And this game reminds me of Disco Elysium, but with strong based combat, and you are necromancer, and you have a spell book, and that spell book can drag you into complete madness. And this is a character creation and it's done in form of story, so you make your choices and some of your attributes will rise and some will fall. And take a look at the upper left portion of the screen, you see these abilities. We have a usual stats like agility and constitution, but we also have a knowledge investigate analyze, impress and convince, and we will need this all to pass a checks during dialogues and other events. And this will be more than important, cause every your action, even conversation, will really matter, cause there will be a trust system in this game. Yeah, town folks must trust you, but you are apprentice of the dark art, and you must lie, convince, flatter, and do all that stuff to convince them that you're a good man, cause if you trust the drop too low, they will just hang you. Oh yes, this is a 1733, a dark years. Your father died, and he was not a simple man at all, and you arrive at his mansion, and there is definitely something wrong with his death, and you must investigate, and everything that happened next will surprise you definitely. Sadly, I don't follow a story for too long, cause in my version of the game, there was a black text on the black screen, and I see only questions question I can ask, cause they was white, and don't see answers at all, it spoils it all, but I believe in final release this will be fixed. For that reason I managed to get only in one, the very first combat, and what can I say about it, it's pretty classical and I know there will be gun power, and of course your spell book later in the game. You will have allies, you will be able to use different kind of weapons, and you will be able to use different kinds of abilities, excellent combat, perfect, nicely done. So what do we have in the end? We have a story-rich gothic RPG with a very interesting narration, tone-based combat and all these checks in Disco Elysium style. Oh guys, don't know what about you, but I wishlisted this game right from the beginning, so link will be in the description of this video. In my opinion, the Necromancer's Tale is a very promising game, we just can't afford ourselves to miss it. And I know there was a few videos lately, that cause I was ill, really ill, but now I'm feeling better, so friends, show must go on, and I will see you in my next video. Meet you there friends, and happy Halloween!